so hello guys and welcome to my channel sir. today again i am back with important numericals on machine design sir. so basically this numerical is from chapter 3 the design of magnetic circuit and from this chapter we will solve all together 3 to 4 problems sir, that are frequently asked in the exam sir. and here the first numerical is and here this numerical is asked in 2019 fall and here calculate the mmf required for the air gap of a machine having core length here the core length given as 0.32 meters and similarly including 4 ducts so number of ducts will be 4 of 10 mm each and pole arc is given as 0.19 meters similarly slot, slot piece is given as 65.4 mm and the slot opening is given as 5 mm and air gap, air gap length is given as 5 mm and flux power pole is given as 52 milliwebbers and given cathodes coefficient as 0.18 for opening power gap equals to 1 and 0.28 for opening power gap equals to 2 so first we need to calculate the ratio for slot opening sir. so ratio, ratio equal to slot opening upon gap length and here the slot opening is given as 5 mm here you can see slot opening given as 5 mm and air gap length given as 5 mm here so ratio will be slot opening upon gap length so it will be 5 mm upon 5 mm that is going to give you so the ratio is 1 and for ratio 1 its scatter coefficient is given as 0.18 so cathodes coefficient for slot case is equal to 0.18 and now gap contraction factors for slot so it will be kgs equal to ys upon ys minus kcs into w naught so six, ys is given as 65.4 and 65.4 and it will be minus here minus kcs means 0.18 into 5 w naught is the slot opening so we will get the value of gap contraction for slot as 1.014 now the ratio will be for similarly for duct we can calculate the ratio as ratio equal to ducts with open gap length and the duct with is given as 10 mm and similarly the gap length is given as 5 mm in the question sir. and here we will present a duct with as wd and gap length as lg so its ratio will be 2 and for ratio 2 here you can see the cathodes coefficient 0 0.28 for opening power gap equal to 2 so it's respective cathodes coefficient at 0.28 so cathodes coefficient will be here 0.28 now gap contraction factor for duct we have obtained for slot now for duct it will be kcd equals l upon l minus kcd into nt into wd and the value of l is given as 0 0.32 here all the data are given in the questions here you can see the core length is 0 0.32 given in the questions So KCD equal to L upon L minus KCD into N into WD and KCD is 0 0.28. Similarly, the number of duct is 4 given the questions and the duct opening is given as 10 m. So 10 into 10 minus 3. And the gap contraction for duct it is going to be 1.036. Now total gap contraction for uh, contraction factor KG will be KGS means gap contraction for slot into gap contraction of duct. So KGS into KCD and on uh, further multiplication we will get here 1.05. Now flux density at the center of the pole bg so bg will be flux per pole upon pole arc in core length and flux per pole is given as 52 mm so uh, 52 milliwebbers so 52 into 10 by minus 3 upon the pole arc is given as 0 0.19 and similarly core length is given as 3, 0 0.32 so the value of flux density will be 0 0.854 weber per meter square now mm required for the air gap will be atg is equals to and here with the formula so remember this formula 8 into 10 to the power 5 into bg kg lg and we have obtained the value of bg similarly kg we have also obtained similar lc lg is also given the equations air gap length so if you substitute all the value you will get the value of mm we get for air gap so it will be 3587 ampere so means 3587 ampere now here we have the next one and this numerical was once asked in 2018 falls a 175 mva 20 pole water wheel generator has a core of length 1.72 m 72 meters and the diameter is given as 6.5 meters and the stated slot open have a width of 22 mm and the slot piece being 64 mm and the air gap length at the center of the pole is 30 mm 
and there are 41 radial ducts. There are 41 radial ventilating ducts with each of 6 mm wide. And the total MMF required power pole is given as 27,000 amperes. And the MMF required for the air gap is 87% of the total MMF power poles. And estimate here. If estimate the average flux density in the air gap if the field form factor is 0.7. So here we have to estimate, we have to calculate the average flux, average flux density in the air gap. So here starting the solutions, the catalyst coefficient can be calculated from the following relationship. And here we have the formula to calculate the catalyst coefficient, Kc is equal to 2 upon pi and tan inverse y minus 1 upon y and log root under 1 plus y squared. And in order to calculate the y for slot, here we have the formula as y is equal to ws means slot opening up on 2lg, similar for duct, duct opening up on 2lg. Now, here you can see WS and WD are the width of slot and the duct respectively and LG is the length of air gap. So ratio will be slot upon 2LG means and here slot width will be and in order to calculate the value of Y we have here for slot here we have WS upon 2LG and WS is 22 given in the equations here you can see. Here the stator slot have a width of 22 mm and the slot pitch is of 64 mm given here. So all the data are given the equation just you need to remember the formula and apply it. So this will be slot with upon 2 gap slot width is given at 22 so upon 2 gap length 2 into gap length so 2 into 30 it is going to give 0 0.367. So catalyst of center slot will be 2 upon pi 10 inverse y minus 1 upon y log root and 1 plus y square and here we have written the value of y just we need to substitute the value of y here. So on substituting the value of y will get the value of catalyst option for slot means KCS. So KCS will be 0 0.176 here. And now gap contraction factor for slot. So for gap contraction factors we have formula as ys upon ys minus KCS into WS and ys is given as 64 and upon 64 minus and KCS we have obtained KCS as 0 0.176 into WS and here the WS is given as 22 here, so we'll use the value as 22. So on simplification, we'll get the uh, we'll get as here 1.1064. Similarly for duct, we have obtained all the data for uh, slot. Now for duct, this will be duct upon duct with upon 2 into gap length and uh, in order to calculate the value of we have duct with. Uh, so duct with is given as 6 upon 2 into 30. So 0 0.1. So all the data are given the equations. Similarly, the catalyst option for duct will be KCD equals to 2 upon 5 and 10 inverse y minus 1 upon y log root under 1 plus y square and substitute the value of y here means 10 inverse in place of y we have used 0 0.1. Similar to 1 upon y means 0 0.1 and a log root on 1 plus y square again in place of y we have used 0 0.1 sir. So Kc2 will be here 0 0.05 on calculation sir. Now gap contraction factor for doctor. So in order to calculate the gap contraction for doctor we have Kc2 equals to L upon B, L minus Kcd into nt into, into wd and Kcd is given as here 1.72 10, 10 power 3 here you can see in the question sir. Here we can see the generator has a core length of 1.72 meter given and a diameter of 6.5 meter given. Similarly, the width is also given as 22 mm and um, slot PCG is also given as 64 mm here. And similarly, the radial ventilating duct each of 6 mm is also given in the equations. Here all the parameters are already given in the equations. So, case, so KCD will be L upon L minus KCD into ND into WD. So this is the formula for gap contraction for doctor. So if you substitute all the values, you will get the value as 1.007 here. Similarly, the total gap contraction factor KZ will be for KZ will be the so it will be the product of a gap contraction for slot and the gap contraction for doctor. And we have obtained the gap contraction for slot as 1.1064 and for doctor we have obtained here this value 1.007. So it will be 1.114. Now MMF required for air gap will be 8, 8 is equal to 87 percentage of 
ये ट्वेंटी सेवन थाउजेंड सिंस इट इज ऑलरेडी मेंशन द क्वेश्चन एज हियर The MMM required for the air gap is 87 percent of total MMM power poles, and the total MMM power pole is given 80, uh, 27 thousand. So 87 percent is of 27 thousand, and this is going to give the MMM required for air gap. So here, it is will be 0 by 87 into 27 thousand. So it will be 2, 3, 4, 9, 0 amperes. And now, it is equal to 8 into 10 power 3. It is sorry, 10 power 5 kg BG LG. And from here we can obtain the value of BG here. So just substitute all the values, all the data are given. So it will be 0 0.8786 where per meter squares and the average flux density in the air gap will be average equals to. And again in the last, here value of Kf is given as here. Here the average flux density in the air gap is the field form factor. Here the field form factor is given as 0 0.7. So this is the value of Kf. So at last in order to calculate, the value of BZ means B average, uh, average flux density in the air gap, we have to multiply with KF. So KF equal to K, uh, sorry, B average equals to KF into BZ. So 0 0.7 into 0 0.876, that is going to give 0 0.615 whatever per meter square. So this was all from this chapter. Sir. Hope you enjoy the lectures. Thanks for watching. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.